it's your boy Willa HNRC, and I'm back with another installment of Let's Watch the Starter Guide with Testament. Now, I don't know if you guys are familiar with the older Guilty Gears, but in Plus R, Testament was a problem. I only played two characters in the game. I didn't play the game for long, but when I did, I only played two characters, Testament and Order Souls. You guys may know me as a Nagori Yuki player, Lab Monster, whatever, but this character might actually be my secondary. So without holding you guys too much longer, Let's get into the video and see what they're all about. Testament excels in the mid range, fighting with a variety oh. of projectiles. Take control of the field by combining these projectiles with long range normals. Oh my god. Stain. Oh, certain moves that looks put the opponent potent. into stain state. A follow-up attack will occur when you hit the opponent with certain moves while they are in stain state. Oh, that's kind of like Kai. Into a combo after the follow-up attack hits. And wait, 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 was that the signature overhead? Offense when blocked. Was that what I just seen? Use this opportunity to go on the offense. Grave Reaper. Grave Reaper. forward with their scythe, sending out a projectile. Oh, look at the little little the lady in the heart sends the projectile forward while the heavy slash version moves at a diagonal is that an active hitbox the whole time strike also has a hitbox oh it is combos into the projectile on him the properties of the projectile change if you hold down the button oh he coming such as increasing the active frames of the projectile the that projectile looks broke a little bit into a succubus and remains for a short while before disappearing. Unholy Diver. Okay. Testament's Crow Familiar flies forward. This move puts the opponent in stain state on hit or block. Or if the projectile from Grave Reaper is on screen, the crow flies towards that position. Really? Watch for the oh, so it, the opponent it attacks the little, the little heart thing, I think. For this move. Yeah. Possession. Testament vanishes and reappears in the position of the projectile from Grave Reaper. Testament reappears in their initial position if the projectile is not on screen. Testament will also reappear in their initial position when the button is held down. <laughs> PC man hunger to play, boy. This what means was that? the move can be used either for movement or as a oh. fake. Arbiter Sign, an attack that tracks to the opponent's position to an extent. The slash version is a low, and the heavy yeah. slash version Bro, is an yo, Injustice? We got, we got projectile mix ups? 50 up 50s? However, be aware that it cannot track the opponent from too close or too far a distance. Oh, so they really want to harp in on that, that uh, medium range. summons a succubus. Who performs multiple powerful attacks this move has quick recovery creating an opportunity to approach together with the succubus the succubus's attacks also put the opponent in stain state on hit or okay block. so you kind of just throw it out to get your mix going on the opponent while maintaining your advantage calamity interesting and that does look like you're doing some damage massive beast unleashing an extremely powerful attack this Yo. move has invincibility so, as the attack comes out so new round making it work well in combos new round for interrupting or not new round cool round that's been a cool round our standing slash and the slash version of Grey jesus Green look at it dominate the grounded neutral game this looks like it's about to be annoying such as forward heavy slash and the heavy slash version of grave reaper cover a large area upwards once she's look at I, I like that move the move that comes down the chance to go on the that looks like i guess it's the overhead i'm not sure by grave reaper yeah look at this lockdown a surprise attack using possession or put the opponent in stain state by hitting them with unholy dive while the opponent is mm. in stain state you can gain the advantage just by connecting the far edge of your pokes with the opponent Keep the opponent under pressure. Only force the to move. Every chance you can to take. I wanted the little, you know, crocodile dog, Thank you but for it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so 
real quick, we're gonna look back into one thing I want to pay attention to is the teleport. Either for movement or because that seems very interesting. I didn't understand how it works exactly. When the button is held down, down. And when the button Come on. estimates will also reappear in their initial if the projectile is not on screen. How far? Okay, way back. Possession. Testament vanishes and reappears in the position of the projectile. Oh God! Yo, what's good? <laughs> Jesus. Testament will also reappear in their initial position when the button is held down. This means the move can be used either for movement or as a feint. Oh, okay, okay. So you hold down, you stay in the same. Okay. So I mean, the character is kind of just straightforward, really. I mean, normals, proper zoning, spacing, things of that nature. So, I mean, really, I feel like character people that are just good at neutral period are gonna have a really good time with this character. I honestly, I want to take this character and make like a lot of setups, like how it was before. But it, I don't know if it's gonna really be possible because this is looking like. It looks like the same character, but more focused on the neutral, because, you know, Strive, so less about, like, unbreathable, like, no <laughs> comfort space mix-ups and all that crazy stuff, if you've seen some of the stuff Testament did. Uh, if I had more time, I would watch it with you guys, but, uh, press right now. But, with that being said, um, appreciate you guys for watching. I'm definitely going to be labbing Testament out on, I think it's March 28th. So definitely come check me out there. I will be coming up with all the, you know, the little hot Twitter tech and all that cool stuff. So again, thank you guys very much for watching. Peace out.